All right, guys, here we are today. Today's workout is uh, part of the CrossFit West Oahu programming deathmatch. Um, this one is the Corona fight. So it's fight gone bad format. So that means it's 17 minutes long, five minute rounds, one minute between each round. Uh, five movements. First movement is what you see here. It's a dumbbell thruster. Okay, you're gonna hold the dumbbell by the bells with both hands, do those for a minute. After that, you know, make sure on those thrusters you get below parallel and then full extension at the top. Maybe try to push that head through the window if your uh, flexibility allows it. The second move is a dumbbell hang clean or in my case I did curls because why not? Uh, did some regular dumbbell curls then went to the hammer curl. Um, Tommy's doing the hang clean, so it is from the hang. You don't have to touch the ground each time. Just get it arm straight and then pop it up to the front rack. Uh, minute three, you've got jump over the dumbbell. So you have to jump over and back each time. Try to get those feet to move at the same time. Um, over and back counts as one rep. So this, you get a lot of reps here. Um, I wouldn't go too fast on this one you can uh, blow yourself up. But at the same time, you can just knock out a whole bunch of them and rest for the rest of the minute. After that, you got the burpee. Yay, burpees. Um, not much to say about the burpee. You got a minute of them. Um, you'll be pretty out of breath by the time you get to these, so you'll be moving kind of slow. Try to hit a number. Uh, I, I think I hit 10 every round and had a lot of time left in each round to rest, so. The burpee chest hits the floor, your actual chest, not your stomach. Um, unless you've got a big stomach, maybe just your stomach's hitting the ground. Uh, and then full extension at the top. You want to clap overhead or at least get your arms uh, up, right? Get those elbows above parallel uh, with the, or above perpendicular to the floor. Last movement is the goblet lunge. You're just going to hold it in the goblet position in the front. Um, and then every one knee down is a rep um, you must step forward you cannot step backwards if you saw that one right in there that didn't count uh, then you have your one minute break uh, I would definitely wait until the one minute break to write your numbers down I would write them down in that one minute and I wouldn't uh, try to keep uh, track of each movement I would just try to keep track of each full five minute round it makes your rest a lot more enjoyable. Okay, after that, you're gonna restart with the dumbbell thruster. So notice, hip crease gets below the knee. Push those knees out. Try not to have your knees collapse to the inside. Keep the chest up. And the handle of that dumbbell should come to about below your chin, just like a barbell would if we were doing barbell thrusters. Um, Let's see, what tips do I have for you on this? Break it up, don't try to do a full minute of it. Break it up into sets. Um, maybe do 20 seconds on, 20 seconds, or 10 seconds off, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Probably be a good way to do it, just to bother the whole thing. Would actually be smart. Um, and you got your cleans, Tommy's doing a good clean there. Getting the full, full lock out of the arm in the front and then driving it up power position. Try to make sure that elbow comes forward. I don't know if my cleans really, or my curls really count as cleans, but whatever. I got, got some arm work in. Um, be careful on these jump overs. Don't land on the dumbbell. You could roll your ankle. That would not be cool. Um, just think fast feet, guys. It's not much higher than a double under. If you could do double unders, you could do a whole bunch of these. Well, that's about it. That is the workout, guys. So you got five movements, one minute of rest, um, three rounds. Try to keep the standards going. Make sure we get that chest up in the burpee. Right, full extension, arms are going up. Feet coming slightly off the ground. Just try to keep your form, guys. That's about it. This You could hit some serious numbers here. You could also... Uh, you also get seriously gassed on this workout. Good luck. We'll see. Uh, this is this one's from Coach Angela. 
We got Coach Stews coming up on Friday, so we'll see how the uh, death match goes this weekend. Make sure you get your votes in for last week's death match. Um, that's about it, guys. See ya.